blocks if you have blocks is great if you don't have blocks find uh, maybe two boxes fill them up with something that is heavy or two drawers that are the same size or um, I don't even know like two gallons of water you might not even need them you're just gonna send your right foot forward square the hips and you're gonna stay here that's staying there the hands can be up great for the hip opener maybe you use the blocks and you have blocks what you do with the blocks is that you end up sinking deeper but please pay attention that your right knee is not crossing the toes your knee is in line with your ankle you're gonna feel the stretch on your left thigh breathing deep through the nose inhaling and exhaling the ujjayi that is the four count breath you remove send it back to the opposite leg before you come to this exercise make sure that you already done a few uh, squats or, or um, you know warming up a little bit on your hips and your legs don't go too deep If you're pregnant, be, I mean, like I'm doing these videos for pregnancy, please be careful in not going too deep because you have uh, so much more flexibility throughout your pregnancy. You don't want to hurt yourself. You don't want to go over the flexibility level. So again, the knee is in line with the ankle. The toes are in front of my, in front of my knee and you can use your blocks and sink deeper or you can send your hands up. You can send the hands in prayer or the hands on the waist or the hands or the leg. Relax your shoulders. Release it. 